Well, the celebrations are just beginning for the president's second term of office. And once the parties are over, of course, it'll be right back to work tomorrow. Political analyst Stephen Caliendo joining us now this morning. So, Stephen, what do you think are some of the toughest issues he's going to face? Well, the immediate issue, of course, is the economy and jobs. We're not past this fiscal cliff uh, mess, right? I mean, it was sort of just delayed for a few months, and so he's going to have to deal with that. And the biggest issue, of course, domestically, is that the Republicans still control the House of Representatives. And while it may seem that there was a, you know, a clear message sent and Republicans were beat soundly uh, in November, that's true, but all these Republican House members won their seats back, and they have the majority still. So that'll be a challenge. So as he's facing this budget crisis, how in the world does he cre create some bipartisan compromise? He wasn't able to do it the f past four years. No, it's going to be difficult. And I think that he feels like that there's an opportunity with some of the new Republicans that have taken the place. I mean, some of the Tea Party folks that won last time in 2010 elections, who came in in 2011, have lost their seats. Others have sort of just lost some of their momentum. So I think he senses that Speaker Boehner might be a little bit more willing to work with him than he was in the previous Congress. So often, of course, uh, people here want the president to look inward and focus on America right. and jobs, but then, of course, the world always That's comes right. into play. This is the problem, right? No matter what the best intentions are in terms of a domestic policy agenda, we always have to be uh, attentive to world events, and presidents have to do that more than Congresses do. And so the, the, the president is going to have to keep his eye on what's happening, not only in the Middle East, but in other parts of the world, and, and definitely respond to those things as they come up. So his biggest challenges worldwide foreign affairs, what do you see it? Well, I think what's happening in the Middle East, for sure, I mean, the, the Iran problem is, is always there. And, and the question about whether Iran is trying to enrich uranium to the point that they can have a nuclear weapon, um, th there's, there's definitely international outcry about that, and the president has his eye on that for sure. Tough right. job. That's for sure. <laughs> Tough job indeed. <laughs> Thanks a lot, okay, Stephen. Sure. We really do appreciate sure. you coming in this morning, and you're going to be here throughout the rest of the morning. I'll be here all morning, too. yeah.